Salam, 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 my people who be all aware. So today we are going on a mufti um, iftar seeking Laylatul Qadr. So that's why we're gonna go and be at the London Excel, and I want to take you guys along as well. So let me go and hurry up, get dressed on this lovely outfit, which is very comfortable. Yep, I was selling this lovely um, um abaya, so I'm just gonna get dressed and then we can go together. Yeah. So guys, now I'm getting ready. Just a little, little, little light makeup, not too much. That's fine. That's it. Yeah. Just have to put my baby slip care. I decided to come and sit here in the in the kitchen. It's a little bit brighter. Wow. Why did I go down? Slip care. So that's our better sleep care. If you guys have yours, go and purchase yours, please. Check us on Instagram, which is Betty Sleep Care. You can have your lip scrub, lip balm, chapstick, lip, lip comfort oil, and a pan. And we have lots of goodies, especially if it's a, like a birthday or something for your little ones. So we do and provide you like a gift box and it's amazing. We have lots of lip care product gift box that every girl will love. Oh, you know, not just the kids, anyone will love. Yeah. So that's it. Let me go and wear my um, gown. Bye. -bye. Okay, let me do my hair tie if, if I have to wear this white one because I'm wearing something black and white. Let me see. I love this head wrap. I need my one apple. What if did you? I have something here, which was the back. Let me just maybe skip when I saw jar. And then you just the material is very good. It goes according to no kubugerek, yeah, and it stretches as well. You can see. Yep. So from here you can just manage how you want it and then tie it at the back let me just leave this cap for my earrings and then that's it guys Ta -da! let me get my gown now so i'm going to wear this and it's a it's one size so i'm going to put a belt on here so that it can give me that shape so yeah you get my soul like menu so this is how the gown looks like if you want you can just put this on top it's up to you it's optional i told you guys this advice can go it's not just for prayer prayer it can go anywhere and it's very comfortable i have put the belt Just to give it that shape. You, know, you guys can see. If you don't want, you don't have to put anything. You can just leave it like that. So I'm just comfortable shoes. And also with this pack. Putting the belt helps it help it helps a little bit, but it makes it, you know, quite a little bit shorter. Yeah, if not do not dig at the call, but put it in But it's very long. So we are all set ready. Yeah. <laughs> That's better and that's Zayna. Yeah. Yeah. For the free girls. Yeah. I'm getting the fashionable girls. Fashionista. 
Yeah, we always. Okay, so we got Betty with high heels. Hey! <laughs> Betty is wearing heels. Where is Zizi? Zizi also is wearing heels. And that's Zainab with the heels as well. <laughs> Hello, hello guys. So we are on our way to the London Excel and Hobby is here. We're marching wide wide. <laughs> yeah. So um, inshallah see you guys there. Look at Betty and Zainab down there. Musa doesn't like camera anyways. Okay. When they accused Aisha of immorality and 
So we have our um, whole iftar pack and after they will um, serve us the hot one. What is it? It's the day of gathering. The day we when have we come together, what do we gather for? And also you gather for prayer. You gather in order to listen to a talk known as a khutbah that will wake you up, that will give you guidance, that will address some of your fears and concerns, some of the issues that are affecting you as a khutbah. That's what the Jumu'ah is all about. And if you don't attend the Jumu'ah, can you really call yourself a Muslim? Can you really call yourself a Muslim when you're not bothered about the Jumu'ah? Let's make an effort, inshallah, we will attend it. A small spoon regularly. and a big spoon. Arrive at the time, and even before the time, and inshallah, so that getting together is very important. This evening we have gotten together 15,000 or more of us. And I love listening to his recitation. I love it so much. I fell in love with this guy. I can't stop watching, listening and repeating over and over again. For some reason everyone is impacted and affected differently by different reciters. And at different times it's another reciter. You might find someone else in a few months time. But for now, for me, this man did it in the month of Ramadan such that I was moved and motivated. Imagine the Quran, the recitation of the Quran, listening to the Quran. If you're not good at reciting it, minimum, listen to it. Try to repeat the words. Wallahi, it brings pain to the heart. When I see young boys and girls, sometimes little children, memorizing song after song after song with words at times that are so embarrassing I don't even think they themselves know the words. I remember a young person who was singing a little song with words and I said, do you know this? Do you know what it means? And they said, no, because it was in another language. So how are you saying it? Well, I just learned what it's saying, you know. Imagine, it's a fact. They learned the words without knowing what they mean because it was in another language and they learned it. Well, how much effort did you put to learn this Quran? It's the month of Ramadan. Didn't we say Allah says Shah Ramadan? Allah the Muslim Quran. The month in which the Quran was revealed. That's one of the most important facts about Ramadan. That's why Allah says it in the Quran. Can't we make an effort to memorize a little bit? Trust me, my brothers and sisters, we can do it by the word of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. May Allah Almighty grant every one of us goodness and ease. May Allah open our doors. Wallahi, we are here in great numbers. We need to be very, very considerate of everyone else. And we need to be selfless tonight. Help each other. I'm sure you already have a pack, the cold pack as they call it. I'm sure you will hear the instruction. When the Adhan goes, inshallah, we will open our fast. We give it a few moments. We will do our Salat al-Maghrib. And after Salat al-Maghrib, we will remain exactly where we are. For guess what? What are we getting? The hot meal by the will of Allah. And then we will, inshallah, enjoy that hot meal. It will take a bit of a time to get it across to all the thousands who are here. Be patient. Once you get it, inshallah, don't forget to say Bismillah before you eat by the will of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. May Allah grant us goodness and ease. And as we eat, we will remember those who don't have food. I want to remind you of something important. When others don't have something, it doesn't mean you should also not have the same thing. If people are struggling in one part of the world, we feel their struggle, we reach out to them, we send them whatever we can, we help in whatever way we can. But that doesn't mean I need to starve to death as well, to show support to them. No, I also need to eat, but I will not be extravagant and I will not show food in a way that I'm wasting or bragging about how much I have. Then it becomes a person who's insensitive of what's going on, but I'm allowed to eat. I can have food walking has also eaten. Subhanallah. So why look at someone and say, why don't you do something for something? When people have so much and they want to brag about how much they have in terms of food and drink and so much lavish.
beings, when others really don't have, then it becomes crossing the line that we should not cross. May Allah make it easy for all of us to grant us the best of this fast today, the best of all the fast we have already fasted, and the best of the days to come. May Allah make us for those who have fasted the month of Ramadan. And we have a little prayer with Zikri this morning and evening. May Allah make us for those who stand in Taraweeh the proper way.
Vienna is one of my favorite. So um, iftar is finished. The iftar with meal was very nice and good. The biryani was super nice. And Yusha Hussain. Yusha Hussain, please come to the front stage, please. Yusha Hussain. So we have to wait for um, the time now. It's about 8.52. So um, um, Tarawik is going to be at half nine. So yeah, we're just chilling. Everyone has um, gone out to freshen up and everything. So it's a little bit quite empty. Let me show you guys. Yeah, because people have gone out to go and freshen up and then freshen up their wudu and everything before our week starts. So yeah. We're some dua and then we're for the Tarawik, inshallah.
prayers guys so I'm just gonna leave you so uh, we have to do the um, shy and also the Tarawih prayers inshallah I'll keep you all in my class and yeah
الدنيانا التي فيها معاشنا وأصلح لنا آخرتنا التي إليها معادنا واجعل الحياة زيادة لنا في كل خير والموت راحة لنا من كل شر اللهم إنا نسألك الهدى والتقى والعفاف والغنى اللهم حبب إلينا الإيمان وزينه في قلوبنا وكره إلينا الكفر والفسوق والعصيان واجعلنا من الراشدين اللهم ادفع عنا الغلاء والوباء والربا والزنا والزلازل والمحن وسوء الفتن ما ظهر منها وما بطن اللهم إنا نعوذ بك من البرص والجنون والجذام ومن سيء الأسقام اللهم انصر إخواننا المستضعفين في كل مكان اللهم انصر المظلومين في كل مكان اللهم انصر إخواننا في فلسطين اللهم انصر إخواننا في فلسطين اللهم انصر إخواننا في فلسطين اللهم أعنهم في غزة اللهم انصرهم اللهم إنك أنت الله القوي المتين انصر إخواننا المستضعفين في غزة اللهم انصر الذين أخرجوا من ديارهم بغير حق إلا إلا أن يقولوا ربنا الله اللهم انصرهم أينما كانوا يا قوي يا عزيز يا جبار السماوات والأراضين يا صاحب كل نجوى ويا منتهى كل شكوى اللهم اشف مرضانا ومرضى المسلمين وارحم موتانا وموتى المسلمين اللهم اغفر لجميع موتى المسلمين الذين شهدونك بالوحدانية ولنبيك بالرسالة وماتوا على ذلك اللهم اغفر لهم وارحمهم وعافهم واعف عنهم واكرم نزلهم ووسع مدخلهم واغسلهم بالماء والثلج والبرد ونقهم من الذنوب والخطايا كما ينقى الثوب الابيض من الدنس اللهم ارحمنا اذا صرنا الى ما صاروا اليه اللهم ربنا اتنا في الدنيا حسنه وفي الآخرة حسنة وقنا عذاب النار ربنا هب لنا من أزواجنا وذرياتنا قرة أعين واجعلنا للمتقين إماما ربنا اغفر لنا ولإخواننا الذين سبقونا بالإيمان ولا تجعل في قلوبنا غلا للذين آمنوا ولا تجعل في قلوبنا غلا للذين That was 20, was it 20 rakas, Betty? Yeah, all I can say next Betty said it's, it's more than 20 rakas, but alhamdulillah, it was, uh, and then um, um, I wanted you guys to um, witness the dua that Mufti was doing as well. So say Amin, inshallah, I prayed for everyone. Amin, mashallah. So alhamdulillah, alhamdulillah, alhamdulillah. Uh, and then we pray, inshallah, may we witness many, 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 many Laylatul Khadr, many, 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 many Ramadan, inshallah, in good health and also, yep, inshallah. So the um, uh, Tarawih is finished and I think as well the program is um, due to finish as well. Yeah. So, yep. I think we're going to go now. Thank you so much.
the street. Looks like my small ajarato is tired. <laughs> small ajarato is enough. Are you tired? <laughs> Yeah. So we're going to the car now. So hello, 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 my people again. So that brings the end of the Lele to Khadr event. It was a very long, <laughs> it was a very long event, but it um it was it it started at 5, 15, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 about seven hours seven hours but thank god i think we arrived here about six or something yeah so and then the tarawig was was long then i did only two and then decided to it was 20 yeah it was 20 tarawig was 20 but it was good yeah so i wanted i wanted you guys to um uh, you know to witness the prayers the festival special um, Dua that Mufti was doing, yeah. So that's why I have to hold just the camera on here so that you guys can witness that. Alhamdulillah, and then say Amen. Ah, uh, yeah, inshallah. So, guys, I'm just gonna leave you guys. Everyone is tired, the kids are tired. I am also tired as well. So, I'm just gonna leave you guys, and then, yep, inshallah, inshallah, may we witness many 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 more ramadans inshallah and many more little hadra inshallah may allah accept all our duas all our prayers all our sadaqah our zakat everything inshallah and then give us good health good health is the key and long life inshallah so guys thank you so much for watching all the time and then i uh, will see you inshallah i think just one i have to just put up one more recipe and then that's it for the ramadan and then inshallah if i'm not too tired i will come i will film um and eat vlog as well but thank you guys for watching all the time and then say bye guys girls bye, bye. and bye from hobby hobbies on the wheels so bye everyone